Hi guys, so it's day two here in New York City. We've got a lot of exciting things planned out, so let's go. And our first quick stop is going to be Madison Square Garden. This venue is legendary, as you guys know, with the history of unforgettable concerts and sport events. And we just made our way to Rockefeller Center. The place is amazing, as you guys know, it's, it's a very vibrant area of bustling crowds and incredible architecture. So we made it to Top of the Rock and if you're in New York you've got to try the Ed Summit one or Top of the Rock but in my opinion you guys have got to try Top of the Rock especially for that amazing view. And here we are at the elevator on my way up to the Top of the Rock and here it is just look at this view it is just unbelievable you can see Central Park right there and it just looks absolutely amazing it feels so surreal there's just no way to describe it other than breathtaking the entire city just stretches out beneath us and you can see the empire state building right there as well and it's definitely worth visiting especially if you're in new york and it's priced about 34 pounds which is like 44 dollars so it's not that expensive and yeah it's just me fully dripped out just enjoying the view and I've just made it over to Central Park and it's the perfect break from all the noise and energy of New York so we're just gonna unwind for a bit and it's just me relaxed just enjoying the beautiful sunny weather and the few people out here biking, running, walking their dogs or just finding a quiet spot to chill get this amazing mix of nature and city life all at once it's such a great spot to catch your breath and enjoy a slower pace if you're ever in New York Central Park is definitely a must. And we're on our way to train station for something that I've been looking forward to all day. And that something is none other than a helicopter door off ride. Um, so this is with Fly Neon. If anybody wants to book, it's with Fly Neon. It's the famous doors off helicopter experience. And I'm just so excited to see the city from above with nothing in the way. They've got a safety video playing right now. So we're just getting a good idea of what to expect and the anticipation is definitely real and finally after so much waiting it's finally time to board and we're getting fully close to the helicopter and you can see how beautiful it looks at night especially with the river view in the background i just can't wait to get up there and see the city from above and we're finally up guys the helicopter's just taken off and trust me guys this is just unbelievable experience You've got to try this out especially if you're in New York City uh, we in the air right now over Kian in New Jersey we're flying over the river right now and New York City is just straight ahead the view is already amazing so far it's very cold I can't lie but I was just wearing a t-shirt so that's why uh, we're heading over towards Manhattan and it's just me as you guys can see it was just freezing cold and here it is guys so the pilot just gave us the signal to put our feet out it's such a crazy feeling having nothing between us and the city below this view is unreal and it's an activity that's just been checked off my bucket list and yeah let's just keep going and i can't wait to see what's coming up next And we've made it over to Manhattan guys and just look at the beautiful lights, the beautiful view. It's just so surreal. And I thought I might get my feet out as well and just enjoy the view. But yeah, right below us, as you guys can see right now, is the World Trade Center standing tall and bright against the city lights. Seeing it from above like this really puts the size of it into perspective. It's just massive and beautiful. But yeah, moments like these, seeing such an iconic landmark from above are just unreal. It's truly a dream come true. I mean, look at this. This is just absolutely beautiful, iconic skyline view. It's truly unmatchable. It's truly something that I just always dreamed of. Honestly, I don't think I'll ever look at New York the same way again after seeing it from up here. It's just absolutely magical.
there's no other better way to see New York City than this. Hands down one of the best. So we're just turning right now, flying right over the Brooklyn Bridge and wow, my heart just dropped at that second. That turn with my feet, I was intense, like a rush of adrenaline that hit all at once. There's nothing like feeling the open air while we're literally gliding over one of the most iconic bridges in the world. The view from here is unbelievable with the bridge stretching out beneath us and the city lights reflecting on the water. Alright so we're almost back on the ground and I've got to say this was hands down one of the best experiences of my life. There's nothing like soaring above New York City with the doors off, feet out, feeling the open air and seeing these insane views. And if you guys ever get the chance to do a doors off flight, take it, it's a 10 out of 10, no question. So after that helicopter ride and an amazing day, it was time for some food because we were absolutely starving. And we're just here at Queens to get some lunch. Queens is known for its fantastic variety of Asian food and it's the perfect way to end the night after such an adventure. Alright, so just heading back to the hotel right now and I was actually walking through this neighborhood. It has some classic American houses. Also, they're like very spacious as compared to the UK. It's got like big yards, loads of room. Really gives you a different perspective on city life. USA definitely has a unique approach to housing and neighborhoods. It's a nice change of pace. That's gonna be it for today guys. Just a mini vlog. I hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.